And you know, me myself, when this guy, he was elected, I was so happy, extremely happy. We don't want to have Hillary Clinton, right? And then when he went and he says Qatar and Muslim Brotherhood, he want to put them in the, in the list of terrorism. I said, finally, there's a guy who will say the truth. In fact, what happened now in Israel, if this donkey, Trump, did not protect Qatar at that time, the attack today never happened. Because the Saudi, they were planning to invade Qatar. Even in the last week of his presidency, he forced Saudi Arabia to lift and open the borders on Qatar. If you don't believe me, go check it out. He have five days left, I remember. Five days left. He spoke to the Crown Prince of Saudi Arabia to lift and open the borders with Qatar. A week after they shake hands. All because of him. Otherwise, Qatar, the terrorist country, number one supporters of the world, or Muslim Brotherhood, Hamas, the prince will not be there by now. The Saudi and the Emirati, they were planning for invasion, and they can destroy his kingdom, so-called kingdom, in five minutes. He's no match for them. It was the stupid Trump. Why? Money. We know why. All right? Now I'm sound like Jordan. I am sound like nobody. Who is Jordan? Patterson? Facts, my friend, facts. If I am I lying, go check it out. Did he force the Saudi to open their borders to Qatar five days? before he left Trump even he warned the Saudi when they were thinking of invasion that I don't approve that and we will not stay watching because remember the American they have big troops in the Gulf specifically in Qatar it's a fact don't tell me you sound like Jordan you sound like a fool he protected Qatar Okay, how you explain to me, you go and you say Qatar should stop supporting terrorism. He meant who? Hamas, Muslim Brotherhood. And then two weeks after, we rent the building of his son-in-law. And then five weeks after, we sell Qatar F-16. How they are supporting terrorists, and then we sell them the most advanced weapon America have. You tell me. Are they terrorists or not? Have you ever heard of somebody he's, he sell weapon to some, a country supporting terrorist? Did he lie when he said they are supporting terrorism in the high level, which means the royal family, they are the one doing it? Yeah, just, uh, you know, just say, you know, this is what most of people do. The second you say something against someone they like, eh, they'll start spitting at you. Right? Right away. He accused him of terror. I mean, yesterday you accused him of terror. How it work? Imagine I go and I say to you, Hamas, we should, uh, uh, they are they are terrorists, and then second day I sell Hamas uh, F-15, F and the deal is $12 billion. How that work? Like, did magic happen? Did they stop supporting terrorists? So you tell me, you know, you keep saying to me, you are sound like this. Foolishness. Money worshippers, zero ethic. <laughs>